Welcome to Evolution of Self with me, Britannia. Hello. This week I want to speak about respect. Um, it's something I've been kind of pondering over and thinking about and I sort of noticed it in, around me and the people that I've worked with and things like that. Um, and I, it's funny, I mean, I, th I think we, or most people I know, realise that respect is something that is earned. But I don't think many people realise how to earn it. I think a lot of people still believe that a title or a position gives you the respect, that you automatically are respected when you have that. But it's not actually true. There's a really big difference between respect and somebody doing what they're told to do because you hold sway over them. I've seen it with parents and children. I've seen it in companies with people that are sort of higher up on the leadership scale if it's a hierarchical company. And it's a big mistake to think that you are respected just simply because somebody does what you say you're going, what, what you've asked them to do. The reason that they do those things is because you hold a position of power, not necessarily a good position of power, but they are reliant on you for things that they need to survive, be it money, be it shelter, be it whatever it is that they believe you can give them. And so they do what you ask them to do simply so that they can carry on getting that need for survival met. That does not mean that they respect you. Respect is a much more subtle, much more deeper um, emotional feeling. When we respect somebody, we will go the extra mile, not because they've asked it of us, but because we admire the person that we're actually thinking of, the person we respect. When we respect somebody, we will defend them, we will stand up for them, we believe in them. When we respect somebody, there's an admiration, there's a, a desire to give a little bit of ourselves to them. I know that sounds kind of peculiar, but I've kind of just been sitting in the feeling of what does respect really mean? Um, and for me, it is. It's giving a bit more of myself to that person. There's a trust. There's um, a deep sense of trust in that person. So how, how do we earn respect? Now, there's a number of ways that I've seen it. Um, in working with people, I have found that I respect those above me who respect me. So it's a case of if you want someone to respect you, you need to respect them first. That doesn't mean that they allow me to walk all over them. It means that they see me, they truly see me. They care about me, they care about the situation I work in, they're, and they're also prepared to work as hard as I am. So for me, one of the things that erodes my respect almost immediately is when someone doesn't work as hard as I do, when they expect me to work harder than they do, and they feel that because their position is above me, that it lets them off lightly, that they can sit back and do less. Um, I find that as soon as that happens, my level of respect for somebody goes down dramatically. I respect people who treat people fairly. I respect people who, who adhere to sort of a, a strong moral code, who have integrity, who try to better themselves. But most of all, I think it goes back to what I said initially, that respect for me is something that is earned by giving respect. And there's another and there's a number of things that this happens with the love is one of those things when we love people they tend to love us back when quite often in the world around us people expect the opposite they expect to be loved before they give love they expect to be respected before they give respect they expect to be trusted before they trust and it doesn't work like that we have to give freely of those things that we want first before we will receive them we have to truly care and see people deeply before those people want to care and see us deeply. So I hope you've enjoyed this little one episode on respect. Um, if you have, please like, share, comment, whatever else. Um, I also have links to my online courses and to my contacts in the show notes below should you be interested in doing any coaching with me. So much love from me to you and have a fabulous week. Bye bye.